Morning, um, just wanted to come on and do a review of the Garnier Ambrisolaire Anti-Dark Spots and Anti-Pollution Super UV SPF 50. So I've been playing around with some SPFs and I bought this one because it was quite cheap, so I think it was £6 from Boots and it's got the anti-dark spots which I'm trying to um, reduce the hyperpigmentation from really old scars from spots and um, things like that and some damage. So um, I have normally been checking the ingredients but for some reason I must have checked the ingredients and missed um, a key ingredient that I think has irritated my skin. I've been using it for about four days and the consistency is actually quite nice. So some of the creams I've got are really thick. This one isn't. So as you can see, it's quite, um, if you can see that, but it's very light and it just absorbs really easy. So it's really light, fast absorbing. It doesn't leave a, like a greasy film or anything like that. So it is nice on application and it dries pretty quick so it's good for under the makeup as well. The only problem is for me is that it contains alcohol DNAT which I think stands for denatured and that is a well-known key ingredient that irritates skin. For some reason I must have missed it and um, luckily it was only six pounds so um, it's not the end of the world but it also contains silica which when I've used other products with silica in, that's also irritated my skin. So that also could be a key ingredient that's irritated my skin. So what it's done basically um, in the four days is just broke me out. I don't know if you can see uh, there. And I've got another one coming in there. So um, stopped using it yesterday and actually they've they're not as red as they were yesterday morning so it's definitely this um, because this is the only thing that I've introduced into my skincare over the last week um, it could be hormones as well because some of these look like hormonal spots but just looking at the ingredients I definitely think it's that so um, yeah so if you have sensitive skin like mine and um, my skin is normal to dry I would say uh, as I've got older it used to be oily then it went combination and now it's more on the dry side um, especially this area here um, but I don't get an oily t-zone anymore really so it's not combination um, so if you've got sensitive skin I would probably um, give this a miss the um, actual claims on this is SPF 50 and it's UVB and UVA so it's also got hyaluronic acid in it that's another thing I might be sensitive to is hyaluronic acid um, I don't even know it's possible but I've used the ordinary hyaluronic acid before and it did nothing for my skin it brought me out in a lot of um, closed comedones which are like um, really small bumps in the skin but they don't actually uh, produce a white head and they're not red they're just like bumps and so I think that's what um, the hyaluronic acid for me so that it could be another ingredient that um, doesn't suit my skin I don't use hyaluronic acid anymore the only one that did um, work for me was the Medicaid but anyway back to this so um, good consistency and um, really good under makeup fast absorbing light and um, easy to apply but it's got denatured alcohol in it and um, for me which is a, another key ingredient is silica so always check the ingredients and um, one of the things that I've started doing as well trying to find the right skincare routine for me is just writing everything down that I use in a book so that I can go back and see what I've introduced and um, what, what my skin is looking like um, and I saw that advice on a YouTube video so um, it actually has helped because I'm now being able to monitor my skin after, because at the minute I'm just trying loads of products, I've got so many. Um, but this is definitely one that I've noticed um, a reaction to straight away. So I thought I would 
review this one now because I'm not going to be using it anymore. Um, and also if anyone knows me wants it, please let me know, you can have it. Uh, so yeah, so that is the Garnier Ambre Solaire Super UV SPF 50 Anti-Dark Spots and Anti-Pollution. Thanks for watching.